Hi all, in this video, let's learn how to improve the web page loading by just sorting the head tags. So what I mean by that, so let's see. So in any, any application, what we do, if we have a head tag and we'll keep on adding the elements to the head tag, we'll not bother about the in which order we are adding. Whatever we feel like, whatever comes into the picture, we'll be adding that to the head tag. But we need to understand this order of the elements in the head tag will really impact the performance of the web application. So then what we need, we can do. So let me show you a Chrome extension. So go to the Chrome Web Store. I'm clicking here, Chrome Web Store, and search for the capo. Okay, this is the first one. So capo. So add this extension. I've already added this extension to the Chrome. If not, like you can add it. And what does this capo extension do? So I'm coming back to the application. So we have a number of tags in a head tag, okay? Those are not ordered in the uh, right way. So let's see, here the extension was added. So I'm clicking this extension. So this extension will give, so these two color palettes. So to get a better understanding, you can go to this console. So in the console, you can see two things are there. Two, one is like actual head order. So this is what we have now in our application. And this is what the sorted head order. This is what the capo suggesting us to reorder our elements. So let's see what is the actual order. If you see 11, 11, so this numbers are weight. So all these uh, elements in the head tags were categorized and uh, they were divided into 11 categories and 11 groups. And they were weighted as 11, 10, 1, 2, 3 to 10. 11 being the highest number, it's a weight high. So that's the reason we need to put this at the top of the head section. And see here, the actual order is one. It means like a least order we kept at the top. And 10 is the highest order, right? We need to move this next to the 11. We need to reorder all these elements one after the other based upon their numbering, based upon their weight, okay? If you find like uh, there would be a color, okay? Uh, red would be the highest and blue and green, gray would be the lowest color, okay? Uh, this is the actual order we have. So what is the order suggested by Capo? So this is 11, 10, 8. So as per the weight, it is ordered, okay? Weight of the element is 11, 10, 6, 8, okay? If you don't know like what exactly the element is, what that functionality of that element which we are putting in, in the head tag, you have no idea about that. Just see this and you can uh, reorder your head section with this numbering. Okay, whatever this capo suggested, you can do. But in if you wanted to learn more, like why this was given a weight of 11, why this is high priority, why this was given a 10, 8, like this, if you wanted to learn more about this numbering, weighting, then you can go here. So I will put this rules, capo rules, in the description of the video. There you can check. See here, you have 11 categories. First category is in 11. Uh, this is like a directive, it's like meta, HTTP equi uh, equivalent directive. This helps us to how uh, to parse and how to handle the document. So this is given high weight. So that's the reason it should be at the top. So if you want to learn about why this weight was given in this way, so I will put this in the rules. But the simple way is like just you can uh, reorder. You can check this reorder and you can just reorder all your elements so that your performance may be a bit improved in your applications. This is all about the capo. So hope you understand. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. Thank you.